Alright everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to finally another episode of Subnautica. I'm not gonna lie guys, I kinda know where we left off and I kinda don't. So this is where we left off last time. If you open this right here, you can see that the prawn suit is now blue. You know, if you didn't know in the last episode, I don't know why you're watching this. You're skipping episodes, what's wrong with you? Go ahead and watch the last one. I'll wait. So in the last video, we got the grappling arm as you can see right here. And don't worry y'all, we got the advice on deck so we're gonna know where to go right now. Let's get into it, let's get into it, let's get into it. Okay, so our first comment is coming from Nugget. He said it's about time that we finish the game, basically. Now, he gave us some directions as to where to go. Biomes, stuff, stuff that we haven't seen, basically. So this first one that he said was to stand on top of the life pod and go to the middle of northeast and east and go 200 meters down. And don't stop until you reach an area called the bulb zone and continue until you see a piece of aurora that and make sure to take the laser cutter with you. You should find a stasis rifle, uh, status rifle. Oh, I think he's talking about the stasis rifle that we found. There you should find a stasis rifle, which, you know, typo, it's okay. You should find a stasis rifle that to be crafted needs magnetite that can easily be found on jelly from biomes. Okay, okay. So, I think we're just gonna do that, unless unless anyone else has a crazy comment like this. Okay, so we're coming up on the life pod. Let's climb up here. Now, he said to look northeast. Right? This way? He said to look northeast that way. And go 200 meters down. Until we see it. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We gotta go 200 meters down all the way that way. Okay, so I think we made it to the bulb zone. And um, it looks like... What is that? Bro, what do y'all have me? Oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> I get so nervous playing this game. Did y'all hear that? There's no door to this. Is that a UFO? What is that? Scanner room fragment? Oh, I already have it. Okay. I guess. Bro, I'm I'm so scared. Stay in this game. Okay. Okay. Just relax. The animals will mind their business if you mind your business. Okay, we're inside. We're inside. Oh. Okay. Thank you. Now before I leave, is there anything else in here? Let's see, let's see. Uh no. He just says that there's a stasis rifle in here, but you know, for my sake, I'm gonna just do like a quick run through of this. Take the stasis rifle, which we can't. We need two pieces of magnetite and a computer chip, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna press square on that thing, we're gonna pin it. Now, I believe we have magnetite. Yep, two. Okay. Now we just need one computer chip, and I, which I don't think that we have. 346 minutes later. Okay, we finally got all the materials that we need for the um, computer chip. I don't even know if that was English. We finally got all the materials that we needed for the computer chip. So let's go over here, electronics, computer chip. Now, we have one of everything that should give us stasis rifle. Freezes physical objects in place. So does this work on like, monsters? Okay. Oxygen efficiency Don't decreased. Run. Oh hey little guy. Okay, so now the next part is that we need to get the Mark Two and Three module to go is to go deep for the prawn suit and this the SS. Oh, the, the SS. Oxygen. Damn. Hold on, let me go get some oxygen. Okay, so now that we have the stasis rifle, our next step 
is to get the Mark 2 and 3 module to go deep for the Prawn Suit and the SS Do Not Eat if you want. You can get it even for Nemo just because it's the cheapest. I guess it's time to get some 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 depth modules. First we're gonna start with the Sea Moth because that's what we need. Now we're gonna need the Sea Moth Depth Module Mark 1, Plasteel Ingots, Magnetite, and Enabled Glass. Not too hard, not too hard. Three rubies is crazy. So I'll see you guys whenever I get all this stuff. Two hours later. Guys. I'm scared. I don't know where I am. I'm just looking for one piece of magnetite, man. Why is there a life bot here? Excuse me? Oh, they're fighting. Did he just get sent to the Shadow Realm? What happened? He doesn't care. He actually doesn't care. First of all, you missed me, you bum. Get hit with this. Okay, so I missed two. As long as he turned around, we're fine. Yep. Get that blob of a brain, bro. Get out of here. Get away from me. Wait. Wait. Get off me. Despawn. They don't stack. So we're gonna have to take this. Now we're gonna have to go here to the modification station. Build the Mark II. Oh yeah. Now we need we just need two more rubies, which we have right in here. Look how prepared I am. Always grab extra resources. Now we can build the Mark III. Excess upgrades. Boom. Crush depth now 900 meters. Nice. Okay. So, next, I think, is the Bronsu depth upgrade. Something that was also needed is the drill arm, but ingredients are unknown. Point number three. You may need the drill arm. So start at your life pod, bring a laser cutter, and go south, southwest, until you reach the blood kelp zone. And when you are there, go down until you reach the reach the deep areas, find a big wreck, and it contains five to six arms. But it's not 100%. The wreck is usually near the power areas and is surrounded by debris and prawn suit fragments. A few moments later... Blood kelp yet? What is that? What are these? Uh, these aren't. Bro. Are you not, like, y'all 
friendly. We're gonna keep going, we're gonna keep going, we're gonna keep going, go up. Okay. No clue what this is. This, this is this is unbelievable. He looks like one of those aliens that um he, he looks like the aliens from that one movie where where when they came to Earth they died because they got human bacteria on them. It's kind of lame. They were the big towers. Y'all know what I'm talking about? What's it called? Um, Global Field. That's the wrong movie. Uh. Yeah, we're looking for this blood kill biome. It's not real. Nugget, you put me in the Twilight Zone. There's a herd of them. Okay. Having three legs is insane. Let me know in the comments if you, if you have three legs. Pause. Pause. Ow. Ow. This is the edge of the map. Is that something down there? Looks like there was something down there. Maybe I'm just tripping. Maybe I'm just tripping. Oh yeah, there's no noise. I'm going back. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. Yeah, because that's what happened to uh. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's what happened to us last time. We went to the ecological dead zone. There was just no noise, it was quiet. No bueno. He said it was southwest. South. And I'm looking. Maybe I missed it. There's a piece of aurora here. Looks like there's a door right there though. Oh my gosh, drill arm. Oh my gosh. That's what we need. That's what we need. We can build it. We'll get another one. Okay, so we got the blueprint. We got the we're done. We're done. We don't even need to be here. I can hear the warper somewhere, bro. I can't stand that guy. Okay, so the drill arm, I'm guessing, is what helps me. Um if you guys have seen, there's like these large deposits of minerals around. There'd be like a gold deposit. It looks like a huge rock. I'm guessing the drill arm helps with that. So. We'll go ahead and head on back to base. Build this drill arm. And see if see what happens from there. Open that fabricator up. Obviously, we can't craft it right now. Oh! Four diamonds! <sighs> All right. Okay. Enables the mining of large resource deposits. Yeah, that's what I. Yeah. Okay. So basically, it just mines the big rocks that we've been seeing around. If you've been watching all the playthroughs. So we need one piece of lithium and four diamonds. Now let's see if we have any in our resources cabinet. All right. Any diamonds? We have three. So we have enough. We have enough. We, we actually just have enough. Uh, put this in there, that. Uh, let's see. We need one piece of lithium. We don't have lithium? I'm over here by the island. Oh, never mind. Lithium. Yo! Get off of it, man! Can't fuck that land, dog. I can't mate with my Seamoth, man. It's harassing Nemo. Good day, sir. So we finally got what we need to build the drill arm. Which was, oh, what can I build here? And build that drill arm. Aw, oh, yeah. Well, we got a radio message. Hold on. I used to think that was the saving button. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, talk to me. 
This is Life Pod 2, coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the okay. rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Okay, going for the rendezvous. Signal location uploaded to PDA. I gotta come up with a better name than Jarvis. I can't keep calling him Jarvis. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Yo, Jarvis. Like, that sounds so stupid. Boom. Wait. So then where's his grapple arm? Oh. Oh, okay. Let's go find ourselves a big old deposit. Yeah, watch this, watch this. Oh. That's like what 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, it's 10. But 10 from one deposit is crazy. Now, I know we said that we were gonna do some live pod missions, but we'll do that in the next episode. We finally got the drill arm, the stasis gun, and we got the. What did we get? Oh, we got some C depth modules for Nemo. Now. That's gonna do it for this episode of Subnautica if you guys did enjoy. Can I do my outro, please? Now that's gonna do it for this episode of Subnautica. If you guys did enjoy, please be sure to leave a like. If you're new here, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. We're trying to hit 500 before the end of the year. Q&A coming next video. Make sure you guys go and the post should be up before this video, so. But go into the community, community tab if you have any questions for me that you would like to ask. Uh, you can ask anything that you want. Just don't be weird. But go ahead and go to that community tab. Let me know what you guys want to know about the channel, or me, or things in the future, maybe. I think that's all the announcements. My name's Triple, and I'll see you guys in the next Anatica video. Peace. This ocean game's amazing.